everybody. I don't know why I do this with my hands. I see a lot of people do this. I don't think they don't know what to do with their hands when they start. But anyways, how are you? I'm fine. Today we're doing Tea Tuesday with my cat cup. Just gotta turn it so you can see. Yeah, we Christmas. I have a lot of cat mugs. But it's just regular black tea today. I wasn't feeling like being fancy or anything. So that is what I am having. I um, thought my camera was upside down. I hate when I do that. So anyways, um, it's Monday night. That's usually when I film these just because my kids stay at my mom's house on Monday night. So it just makes my life easier because when the kids are here, it is very difficult to try to communicate with everyone and have like, you know, talky videos just because they're very loud. They're kids. Um, yesterday was my daughter's birthday. Lilith turned 11 years old. I will insert a picture of her cake because I don't put pictures of them in there. <laughs> and um we had a good time we got our pizza she i made her birthday cake she got um all the little things she wanted and asked for her. she's she's very she's a good girl she doesn't usually ask for too too much <laughs> same thing with like christmas and stuff she's very realistic compared to the other children my other daughter she has a list for christmas and it has like everything is like 50 60 dollars and i'm like no so that's not happening but yeah so that's what we did yesterday we had a really nice time i know she had a good birthday the only bad thing about it was she's got a little bit of a cold so i don't think she you know was a little sad that she couldn't enjoy it as much as she would like to just because she was not feeling well she was very congested but she played and had a good time besides that um they went back and did their school today this is the last week for us i don't know how it is in other places and then we have a two week vacation for winter break. They won't go back to school, I think, until it's January 4th, I think it is. It's the third or the fourth, I can't remember. But, um, so yeah, they're excited about that. I'm excited about that because I do not like to do schoolwork. <laughs> and, uh, you know, I don't know for all the new people, I've said it before in past videos. I always, I was homeschooled. I don't know how my mom did it it's very you have to have a lot of patience and i don't sometimes so it's very difficult sometimes and before the pandemic they were going to regular school i didn't plan on homeschooling them like i was that's what ended up happening once the pandemic came obviously they like it a lot better being home with me all day and doing whatever you know they're doing schoolwork but like they don't have to worry about other people or whatever it's just they can you know but yeah all I'm saying is if it wasn't for the pandemic, I don't know if uh, Kitty would have been homeschooling her kids. Probably not. But yeah, that's that's the best solution for us right now. I know some people still send their kids to school. My sister-in-law sends her kids to school because she's comfortable with that. And you got to do what's right for your family. So I don't pass judgment on anyone that does send them or doesn't. They're your kids, you know. But anyways... Um, so that is what's been going on. They're really excited about having their winter break. And hopefully a cold doesn't start circulating because she doesn't feel good. My sister doesn't feel good now. And I'm like, it's only a matter of time before it gets to me. But I'm hoping that doesn't happen because I have the next like two weeks are going to be a lot for me. Because I do a lot of cooking and baking and stuff like that. I promised my brother cookies for his um, co-workers. I gotta get all that done. I have one more Christmas present to complete, which is gonna be a little bit time consuming. And today is the 13th, so I don't have a whole lot of time. I need to get my butt moving on that. I have not finished wrapping. It's not done. I have a quarter of what I need to wrap wrapped. So I'm behind a little bit. Um, I'm hoping tonight to get a couple things done. I know I have to edit some videos tonight and um, they will be out of order, as usual. Sometimes that happens, especially now that I do Tea Tuesdays, because even though I film this the day before I make it, I have others. Sometimes I film throughout the week that don't get edited in enough time. But whatever, you know, it is what it is. <laughs> we're, we're all doing the best we can. So, yeah. Um, besides that, I, started, I finished watching Only Murders in the Building on Hulu. Um, if you haven't seen it or don't know what that is, it's like a mystery comedy steve martin's in it and steve not steve steve martin and martin short i always like movies with steve martin and we watched a lot of them when i was younger so when i saw he was in a show i was like yeah i'm gonna watch that and uh selena gomez is in it 
But we finished watching that today. It was really good. And if you haven't watched it and you've thought, is it worth watching it? I think it was. I would suggest it. So, yeah, I finished watching that today and that was good. I watch a lot of YouTube videos for, like, my entertainment. Um, but when a lot of the people I follow don't make anything, because not everyone I watch makes stuff every day. So I usually end up trying to find other stuff. And me and my mom watch stuff together. But there's only so many things. Me and my mom watch a lot of, like, investigation, discovery, um, like the shows like Evil Lives Here and all that stuff, or we used to watch Snapped a lot, but sometimes it just becomes too much with the murder and all that. So I'm like, I don't know if I want to watch that. I usually take a little break and then we'll go to other things. Christmas movies we always watch with the kids and stuff. And I have my shows and stuff I watch during the week with them, but yeah. So right now, now that that's over and I finished watching that, I don't know what me and my mom will watch besides our regular YouTube stuff we do. So I have to figure that out during the week. Um, and try to find a new show. I finished, uh, Shit's Creek. That's on Netflix. And my mom hasn't watched that yet, but I don't know. My cats are so bad. I don't know if she'll like that. Like, some things that I think are funny, she doesn't think is funny. So, we'll see. Maybe we'll start watching that. Another thing is certain shows I won't watch if I know the kids are around. Even though they're doing school and stuff, when they're done, I'm not gonna watch a show like that while they're around. So, can you guys stop? The cats are so bad. Tonight's an easy dinner. I am making frozen pot pies for dinner because not every night has to be, you know, culinary cuisine. It's exhausting. <laughs> I have so many other tasks to do that I just rather have an easy dinner tonight. I got, since Lily's birthday was yesterday, I have a bunch of trash and stuff I gotta get together, like birthday wrap and all that, and streamers and balloons I have to take down. I decorated my dining room and that's what I'm looking at right now. And I have to take all this stuff down today. And try to get that done. I did get paint for my doors and trims. I would like to try to get that done during the week with Christopher. But we'll see if that happens. Stuff always ends up coming up. <laughs> and nothing I want to get done gets done. Um, yeah. But besides that, stop eating stuff off the floor. The cats are terrible. Um, there's a kitty outside that Chris told me about. And he's like, there's a little black cat sits on our little sidewalk and I was like what and he's like yeah and he told me and I was like I have to steal that cat and uh he always says he doesn't want more cats but I feel like he secretly does because why would you tell your wife who's like the cat the cat lady see they all come sit with me near the table because I think I can like hang out with them since there's no food on here but anyways why would you tell your wife, the lady who like is obsessed with cats, that there's cats outside that don't have a home? I'm going to steal them. That's what happened with Pumpkin, and now he's inside. And the thing is, I love cats. I have three. I don't want to keep adding to it because they become a lot of work. <laughs> and it's, you know, and they start to, like, especially if they don't get along. Like, Pumpkin still starts with the other cats. So, but now he told me that black one's out there, and I'm going to want to try to take it. So if I see it, I'm going to try to lure it in. I kind of hope I don't see it again because I don't know how the rest of them are going to act. Baby hates the other cats. Well, she likes cats, but Pumpkin she's not a big fan of because he's always starting with her and messing with her. He's standing next to me. I'm petting him. He's such a pretty boy. Come here. Come here. See, there's my pumpkin, baby. All right. Get down. All right. I think I'm going to end this here. I've gabbed on long enough. Sorry if it feels like a lot of complaints, a lot going on. Um, I appreciate you guys watching this. Um, and I will see you in the next one. Thanks, guys.